All right. <laughs> so looks like we overloaded the system, <laughs> so we will try again. I think we're doing, here comes Severus next. Yes. I, if, 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 if this happens again, I think we'll have to switch to just, just Karaoke contracts, not our GarageBand, because I think GarageBand might be so large that can, the computer cannot handle it. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> are we ready for Severus? We are. Okay. Here comes Severus, here comes Severus, right down scissors and... Trixie and Sissy in a tizzy, eager to apprehend. Bellatrix, killing us is so willing to make the ungrateful vow. Clasp your hand, fill and grab your wand, cause people say bring us on cow. Here comes Severus, here comes Severus, right down the dungeon hole. Yeah. He's got a cauldron filled with potions for wizards and witches all. Sleeping dark drooling, flubber words oozing, oh what a magical sight. Stir it slowly and wave your wand for a better city standing to your right. Here comes Severus in the gross bathroom on the second floor. Saving a Slytherin from getting murdered by his nemesis a Gryffindor. Snape knows that he knows how the lady of the advanced potion making. While the vicious parts attack your enemies with sex jokes, I'm gonna have a sink of skin under dark hearts. Well, here comes Severus, here comes Severus, always with a snarky remark. He'll come around when Voldemort calls, summoned by his dark lord. The sword of Gryffindor will appear if Harry just follows the dough. Thank the goblins for this poor crux story, cause Severus is fighting with love. Cause Severus is on our side. We did it. Yay! <laughs> Woo! Man, flawless. Not really. Everything's perfect. <laughs> so perfect. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Excellent. Holly Phoenix. Holly Phoenix feather wand. I see. Are you watching us live? I just wanted to make sure it was going through and didn't stop <laughs> on us. I'm not watching. I'm not looking. Our video's happening here and there. Oh, two people viewing. One of them is me. One of them is you. <laughs> Congratulations. Oh, little heart. Look, Amanda's joined. Us. Oh, hello. Oh, it changed it to oh, you. Thank I you. I say us. Thanks, SB. Thank you, SB. You're just so sweet. What was the song you said? Holly, Holly Phoenix? She other one? Who doesn't oh. like a sword? Well, Mermanda made that sword. Oh. It was a very nice I made sword. It I'm a goblin. You're a, you're a goblin. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Holly Phoenix Feather Wand. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. Yes. <laughs> you're like, maybe. <laughs> Have a Holly Phoenix Feather Wand. It's the best one of his year. I don't know if it'll impress Joe after a butter beer. Have a holly phoenix feather one when you walk to the great hall. Jeez your enemies, but don't get caught, or you'll lose house points for all. Oh, ho, the mistletoe out to the DA met. Cho Chang waited up for him to bet Harry's first kiss was wet. Have a holly phoenix feather one if you build all haters by flu. Oh my golly, hope a holly phoenix feather one chooses you! When we were uh, recording this song, Miss yeah. Kate was uh, my favorite thing. I made fun of her because it's oh, the in my life. This is a story. <laughs> oh, oh man. Oh, gee. Oh, oh, a holly phoenix feather one is the best one of his year. And then she would say, I don't know if it'll impress Cho. And she just kept being very proper about it. And I just loved it so I just, much. And I was mocking her. And so that's why now it's all. In, diction is important, children. It is very diction important. is very She's important. So diction. <laughs> but it was just like, Sometimes. I don't know if it'll impress Cho. It was. What's it our was, next? It was extreme. I loved it. <laughs> I should really check what song it is before I come here and sit. Oh. Old Boldy Night. Okay. Oh. <laughs> is that next? Yeah, old Boldy. Old Boldy. Old Boldy. Old Boldy. Old Boldy Boldy Night. Oh, man, I need some water for that one. So that you can do your alto ooze. Oh, yeah. Am I, I'm ooing. It's you. Yes. yes. Excellent. <laughs> alto ooze. Alto ooze. Any altos out there who really love to ooze? Please ooze along with us. Yeah. 
You good? Yeah. Okay, excellent. Whew. Should have yelled so much while we were talking. Oh, moldy night, the stars no longer shine. It is the eve of older mortal. Long death eaters lie in dark cells pining till he appeared and freed them from us a thrill of hope, the death eaters rejoice in, for yonder breaks a new pure blood world. Fall on your knees, oh hear the dark lord's voice. That's a punchline to a, and a slither <laughs> walked into the room. All right. Okay. This has our musical intro, right? Yeah. Uh, I told Caitlin when we were recording this one, instrumental first verse, and she made this beautiful glockenspiel part that I was like, what is this? And she's like, instrumental first <laughs> verse. And I was like, oh, this is lovely. This is, I, I okay. made an instrumental first verse. <laughs> it was so good. Um, Please clear the room for um, dance, interpretive dance solo. <laughs> Captain Father, the 
Props needed for silent halls. Silent halls, please. Silent halls. <clears throat> oh, Rebecca. I want your daughter's lyrics so bad. <laughs> I want them. Okay. There's. Is there a Mrs. Norris around here? Mrs. Norris? Anywhere? Anywhere? I think we hid most of the cats. <laughs> Should have a fire going on the on the TV there, like I did last night. Instead, there are ads for for Netflix. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> okay. Anything else you need for Silent Halls? Uh, no, I don't actually know how to use the props that I have there. <laughs> oh. Okay. Well, we're gonna just make it up. Yes. Okay. All right. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
Foxy props. That's right. <laughs> 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 Woo! Miss Kate for having this ever ready box of props. I love You should have seen her when we were recording this song. She was like, she had like four things in her hands and she was like, and then she would just like switch props and she pretty much did that whole track by herself. I think I added maybe like one thing. Oh my gosh. It was great. Our dear friend Rebecca has sent us her daughter's version oh my gosh. of Here Comes Voldemort. Oh my, oh my goodness. All right. Here we are putting that up here and we are that doing it. That's so fun. We oh are my gosh. All right, we're gonna. I'm gonna put it on. I'm gonna put it on the karaoke of "Here Comes Voldemort." Or do you want to do the our Severus version? Your choice, Miranda. Either. Okay, do I have it here? I might have taken it out. Oh, you took it out. Okay. Possible. Okay, then I'll, I'll play our "Here Comes Severus" background, but we'll use the "Here Comes Voldemort" lyrics. Do you have it on your phone? I do. Okay. Thank you, Rebecca. Thank you. This is so exciting. I know. I'm so excited. Live from Bubble Snuggle, a pirating of somebody else's song. <laughs> What's your daughter's name, Rebecca? Yes. Who are we? Who is whose song are we? Are we stealing today, Rebecca? Who's the brilliance? Oh come on. Who's that rest? Here comes Everett. Come on, Oh, I'm ready. I'm so excited. I wish like, we had like, we should do the Elvis version of karaoke. Oh, yeah. Here comes oh, Voldemort. That oh, so yeah. Funny. That's what I'm doing. I'm finding right now. Thanks, Here. Elizabeth Boyle. Oh, Rizzy. Here comes Sarah. Santa. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. If I can find the Elvis one, we're doing. We're doing. Here comes Voldemort. Yes. Elvis Presley style with yes. no lead vocal. All right. We're going to try this one. You're at, all right. We're just going to go for it. This one's for you, Elizabeth. Come on, come on, computer, you can do it. Come on, computer, you can do it. Yeah, come on. Oh, my. You have the lyrics? Yeah. Here comes Voldemort, here comes Voldemort, right down dark, dark way. Bella tricks the axe lead all his minions are having a joyful day. Double doors and out glass so all this world is merry and bright. It's gonna take over the world because Voldemort comes tonight. Here comes Voldemort, here comes Voldemort, right down the dark far way. He's got a sick patch, they play the idiot, they just muggles pay. The Potter Brad is gonna die in a flash of green light. had tweeted um, JK Rowling and was asking if there were any Jewish kids and she said yes and she named one child so this goes out for you Anthony oh Anthony and all of our Jewish friends all of our all the boys and girls 
At the Neo and the knee join Dumbledore's army. Let's practice stunning. You can pair up with Ernie. You might get expelled, but you know expelling armless. What can we expect from your corporeal patrons? And while we are walking the corridor on the seventh floor, Three times you'll pass the troll ballet class, and there will appear the door. Three times you'll pass the troll ballet class, and there will appear the door. Three times you'll pass the troll ballet class, and there will appear the door. My favorite. I love that one. I like a good ending. Everyone loves a good ending. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what's next? It's our last. <gasps> oh. It is. It is. Thank you so much and for joining. And here we have come here, our dear sweet friends, to the end of our Muggle Snuggle sing along. Thank you for if you watched part one, and thank you if you've watched part two. And wishing you a very, very Harry Christmas. <laughs> Um, no. Oh, here it is. Okay. Find in the props. Find in the props. Oh, and yes, in, in our karaoke tracks, we have the musical stylings of my beautiful wife, Stephanie. Oh, we're using the karaoke track. What? I, the, yes. I thought this is what you wanted. I did. I forgot. <laughs> I just forgot. This is even more delightful. I get to ooh. A soprano ooh. Have yourself a very hairy Christmas. Lumos be your light. From now on, your tummy guys is out of sight. Have yourself a very hairy Christmas. Dread the Yule dance. From now on, you'll think of me of this joining and we hope that you all have a very hairy Christmas now. <laughs> Bye guys! Bye.